All right, guys, today I want to go over some of the engine mods that I've done uh, to my 2.8 liter V6 Isuzu Trooper. So without further ado, let me show you what I did. All right, so if you look down here in the manifold, you're going to see a throttle body spacer, and that's about an inch thick. Now what that does is it swirls the air coming in and maximizes the volume into that manifold. All right, so on top of that, you're going to see the uh, TBI. Now that is from a 4.3 liter Astro van, I believe it was, and uh, I found that on eBay. If you look up, you can, you can definitely find them there. Um, it's not that hard of a mod. What you're going to do is take a picture of, your, of the one you currently have on and go on there and try to match it up as, as best as you can. Now this one here, one of the vacuum ports was not drilled out. If you take a look right in there. And what I did is drilled it out, put a fitting in that would fit that hose there. And that was super easy. Just basically just drill it out, clean it out really well just to make sure that there's no spurs in there. And um, it was a pretty easy mod, like I said. You just have to match it up the best that you can. Now you also have to remember too, when you do this, you're going to want to get the intake manifold that matches the um, the, T the new TBI that you have. So you're going to have to get it ported. You can either take the one that you have off or um, I'll post in the body the, of a person that you can contact that you can probably purchase this whole kit from. All right, and I'll put that in the, in the description. Um, now, if you look on top of that, you're gonna see something that they call, I believe it's a salad bowl, and it just funnels the air in so it's, when it comes in, it's smoother and doesn't hit any angles coming into this TBI here. Now, you know, Obviously, I've got three things stacked on top of each other here. Whether all this works, I'm not sure what's working and what's not working, but I can tell you that it's def it definitely made a difference um, as far as performance goes, all right? Um, another mod that I did here was putting on an electric fan. Now, you have to make sure that you build a shroud for it or else you're just gonna be grabbing hot air from around the engine. Um, so what I did is I made a shroud for it and then I also covered it up with aluminum tape. Um, so it stays cool. And I know you're going to have some people saying, well, that doesn't make a difference. I'm going to tell you right now, it makes a difference. Your engine sp uh, uh, spinning that big fan um, makes a huge difference. And this engine, as everybody knows, it's a dog, right? So that being said, um, that's controlled by a, um, by a fitting here that you put in between your radiator hose and your manifold that turns on and off the fan. And I got that off eBay as well. All right, another mod that I did, if you guys take a look down here, I removed the catalytic converter and I put a straight pipe. So what I did is I removed the cat, I cut off the two end pieces and then welded this pipe directly onto those end pieces and then uh, basically just bolted them right back on. And um, definitely sounds better, that's for sure. And you can definitely, there's definitely some improvements in the horsepower and acceleration. So that's a definitely, that's a plus. And I can get away with it because it's a 1990. Uh, there's no emissions here where I'm at. So, and I know what some of you will say, oh, well, that's better than the environment. Well, listen, I mean, every hot rodder that you see, they deleted their cat. So there's no catalytic converters in their cars. Um, and then I'm running 33s on this, uh, on this truck. I've got the Extreme MT Mud Claw. It's a mud tire. And I think they're made by Eldorado. And um, it's definitely a nice tire. I'm definitely happy with it. And I'm able to, to push these no problem with these mods. Um, let's start it up so you can hear what it sounds like. So I've got a uh, turbo welded muffler under there. If you could see that. And uh, it was pretty cheap. Sounds good. It's got a nice little rumble to it. I think that muffler was like $30. So, all right, so let's go take a ride, see what it sounds like. So you can hear um, inside the vehicle and acceleration. We'll bring it up to like 75 miles an hour. All right, guys, so let's hear what this sounds like. This is with the windows up.
about hitting 75. Acceleration's not bad at all compared to what it used to be. All right, guys, so that's everything that I've done performance-wise for this vehicle. Um, maybe next episode we'll do like a walk around. I'll go over all my mods, and then you guys could comment on what you want to see and how I did it. So um, if you enjoyed the video, make sure you subscribe and make sure you hit that like button. Until next time.